<clears throat> hey everybody, One Life on Battle here. So, in the last episode, we went ahead and we went through some of Victory Road. And off screen, I did some off screen training while going through Victory Road. With that being said, um, just want to let you guys know that I went ahead and used all the money that I saved up for items. Also, like, uh, I bought a crap ton of max potions, revives, full restores, just in case, you know, just to be safe. Uh, these are all the levels of my Pokemon. I got Rata at level 50, Narodin. You know, I'm just gonna use the normal names. I got Raticate at 50. I got my Nido King at 51. Got Jolt at 53, or Jolteon. Got my Fero at level 50. Got my Jesse or Lapras at level 55. And my Brood at 50. So they're all basically sitting at uh, 50 level and whatnot. But I'm pretty. I'm actually very sure that the uh, Pokemon inside the Elite Four are all like level. 55 or 60 but I think we'll be okay so I'm gonna go ahead and do this and we're gonna be going this is gonna be the final episode we're gonna go straight through this elite four no matter how long the video is and uh, yeah and then immediately I'll start getting ready for the Pokemon blue uh, series all right thank you for watching and enjoy everybody all right let's go there we go oh uh, this is the water water one so I'm gonna go ahead and switch it into Jolteon Result. I kind of should use my brute root, but you know what? Yeah, he could use the XP. Besides, I have plenty of restores, and he can heal himself, so he should be okay. Alright. Welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Lorelei. Lorelei? Lorelei? Of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. Haha, <laughs> are you ready? I really hope I don't get frozen. And I really hope I'm not that strong against my Venusaur. But I think we'll be okay. Dugong? You know, you know I probably should have given my Brood a sleep in it, but Hey, look, it's level 54, so that's good. Brood needs Leap Seed. Let's go, baby, let's go. We're going straight into you guys, because I know y'all want to... See the end of it and the ending and all that stuff and see that last final fight. Alright, Razor Leaf. What? I missed! No! Oh, well, you went to sleep. So, you just put yourself in a pickle, Dugon. Do you not realize that? There we go. There we go, Brute Oh! Oh, almost a one hit KO! Almost! Oh, dead. Yup. Hell yeah, Brute Brute. Alright, Cloyster, Cloyster, Cloyster. I think I'll be fine out there. Alright, Leech Seed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna Leech Seed the hell out of him. All of her Pokemon. Aurora Beam? That's gonna do some damage. Oh, shit. Okay. Doesn't Aurora Beam, like... Lower the attack or something like that. There's a chance I can lower attack or something. But anyways, yeah, you guys. So today, I actually took some time out and was watching a good old movie. I don't know if any of y'all remember, but I think it was made in 1998, and it was the movie called Brink. And for those of you who don't know, that is a inline skating or rollerblading movie, and it's actually really good. It's on Disney Channel. Uh, obviously, I watched it on Disney Plus. This is no. Sponsor for Disney Plus, but yes, I was watching Disney Plus and it was awesome. I really brings back memories, you know. Definitely. There you go, slow bro. Leech scene. Hell yeah, Bruger, ready to go. I'm wondering if I should skip through. You know, no, 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 no. We're gonna make this a two-parter. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make this a two-parter, you guys. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna see how far I can make it through this one. And then that'll determine what I'm gonna do for the next episode. Amnesia. Oh, shit, this special's really going up, huh? Alright. Damn, he's really trying to do a strong ass hit, that's why. Come on, get that critical hit, Brute Brute. That is what I am talking about, baby! Yeah! Yes! Alright, Lorelei is gonna send out Jinx. And I will not be using Brute Root versus Jinx, so... Jinx is a Psychic and an Ice type? Uh... Uh... I can't use... 
fighting moves because that'll be weak against what's the face. So, I think I'm just going to send out Jolt and just use a really strong Thunderbolt. Hopefully, do a lot of damage to her. There we go, Thunderbolt. Hell yeah, he's faster than her. Which, by the way, I think I just searched up, or I just not looked up his speed. I think it's at like 190 something. I gotta double check that. Hell yeah, that quick attack always comes in clutch. 160, there we go. About to use Lapras. Yes. And I know my Jolteon can take down Lapras, but I want my Brute Root to get EXP too. There we go. 56. It's alright. It's alright. You'll be okay, Brute Root. Don't worry. You'll be alright. Lizard. Oh shit. Brute Root might be dead here. No shit. Oh my gosh! Dude! One hit KO! It's alright! It's alright! It's alright! Let's go! Thunderbolt! In case you guys are wondering, I will always have a Thunderbolt over the move Thunder. Just because, obviously, Thunder has a lower chance of hitting, lower accuracy. Uh, and Thunderbolt is always a very strong. God damn! A critical! What the fuck? This is not good, you guys. This is not good at all. You know what? Rata, his Hyper Fang is very strong. Let's go, Rata. This is where you come in clutch, man. No! Rata, if you die here. If you die here, man. Don't die! Shit. Alright, Rado, this is your last chance, man. Hyper Fang! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Lower lanes defeated. Alright, that's cool, that's cool. We're gonna get ready and get ready for the next battle. You're better than I thought. Go on ahead. You only got a taste of Pokemon League power. I know. I was not expecting to die like that. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright. Go ahead and revive Jolteon. I was not expecting Jolteon to die for sure, man. Damn. I'm gonna use max potions. Souls for stars are more important for other things. There we go. Yeah, I went ahead and used all those carbos and proteins and stuff that you get throughout the game. To increase my Pokemon's stats overall. But yeah. Alright, let's go to the next one. We are ready. This is Bruno, and he I think he starts with an Onyx. So I'm gonna I'm gonna keep my Bruno out there. The rigorous training people and Pokemon can become stronger. I've weight trained and my Pokemon life. We will grind we will grind you down with our superior power. Alright. Alright, let's do it, Bruno. I know you ain't that strong. Your onyxes are not that that badass. Alright, Razor right, Leaf, their asses. I'm actually surprised that my Brood Root went first because I know onyxes have really good speed. KO, that's what I'm talking about. Critical hit, but I'm pretty sure he still would have died due to him being. And being rock and crown. Hit my chin. I, you know what? That's why I have Jax. You know what I mean? This is exactly why I have a Jax. Or a uh, Fira. Which reminds me, I was thinking about catching Moltres. They, they give you the option to catch Moltres in the inside the uh, Victory Road. But you know what? No, I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna use too much of overpowered Pokemon. I know my my beginner Pokemon can do just fine in the V4. So. Sorry about that, you guys. My PlayStation is on, and it just now said that something was installed. Uh, let's go ahead and send out Brugger, because I didn't even pay attention. Oh shit, Hitmonlee? Alright. It's alright. Hitmonlee don't have any uh, moves that can do any real damage to Brugger, so... He should be alright. Because I know fighting is weak against grass. Hell yeah, it is. Look at that. That still did some damage, though. Oh my gosh. Alright, Razor Leaf his ass. Oh! <laughs> Critical on him, 
fuck? Ch Emma Lee! Oh shit! That was badass. Alright. Level 51. Onyx. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. I know you have a Machamp left, and once you send him out, I got something for your ass. You know what? I probably should have used Mega Drain right there. God damn it. You might be five levels higher, but that ain't no that don't mean shit. You see how you got you see, this is a little inside tip for those of you who come to the Leaf Four with intense high level strong power moves. Yes, you come to the you come to the Leaf Four with high level strong moves. But if those high level strong moves don't have a lot of PP or power points, then you're not gonna be doing overall a lot of overall damage. So if you have moves like Drill Pack that have twenty power points, yeah, I would rather have something I would rather have the move Drill Pack that can use uh, that has 20 power points rather than having the move fly that has like 10 or 15 power points or some shit. Just because there's more overall DPS with more power points. You get what I'm saying? So keep that in mind you guys. That's why my Brute Root still has Razor Leaf. Because yeah, Razor Leaf is barely a 65 or a 55 power move. But it also has a high critical hit chance and it has more PPs compared to Solar Beam. You know what I mean? So keep that in mind you guys. I'm actually gonna, uh, I'm gonna end the episode off right there. Let's, let's go into the uh, next room. Alright, so this is Agatha. I'm gonna end the episode off right here. And, uh, in the next episode, we will be taking on Agatha. And then the next one after that, which is then, let's see, we'll have Agatha, which is one. And then, I think the, what's his name, Draco or something? I forgot the Dragon Trainer. But then the Dragon Trainer will be next. And then after the Dragon Trainer, it will then be Gary, or Blue. So... Alrighty, you guys. I will uh, hit you guys up later. See you guys in the next episode. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And bye.